Alright, hey, motherfuckers, we in here. Got my phone down for a second. I was fixing my controller. Motherfucker kept on blinking. I don't like when my controller blinks like that and shit. It, like, blinks continuously, you know? I ain't with all that bullshit, man. Still blinking, what the fuck? Whatever. I'm talking about like this. Anybody else's controller do that? It's a rock and a controller, by the way. <sighs> Take GTA 5 out for, for a second. Where the hell is my case at? I lost my damn case. Fuck. Oh. I heard it. Put GTA 4 in right quick and do two videos of this. And then I'll do, do two GTA 5 videos. And before I do that. Don't finish this reminiscing with J series for tonight. Alright. What's up, son? Reminiscing with Jay. This one is drinking for the first time. Oh, what the fuck is going on? This game freeze, did it? Oh. And I hate my games freeze, bro. And I got this used, so. Yeah. I went to go get this. This one was still what, forty something dollars in the store. I got this for twenty five. It's a difference. That's the difference between the new games and used games. Used games you get cheaper, you know. But I regret getting UFC twenty ten. I got that used, and that shit don't even work. Um, what else did I get used? Max Payne three. The motherfucker keep freezing in the first fucking mission. It just pisses me off. Thank God I beat the game already, though. I like that I beat the game. Yeah. Damn. See where it says loading story complete? You can actually see that shit clearer on the, um, on the camera than on the TV. But anyway. <coughs> Drinking for the first time. Now this happened in uh this actually happened last year. This was fourth of July twenty thirteen. Now why are you banging me that damn dough like that, man? I need to chill these damn interruptions. My little four year old sister was already being Call me, you gonna have to wait. I already started my video, we almost five minutes in. No, nope. See what I mean by my mama? Even when I record a video, no, when I record a video, even when I'm in the middle of recording a video, she always calls me 
always, no matter what. I'm not saying I'm going to finish this video. You know, no, you're going to do what I said. I'm like, really? God damn, man. Mommy. Mommy. She was doing that when I was doing my Heaven's Cell 2014 preview, you know. Maybe I should start recording late at night, you know. <laughs> Four o'clock, five o'clock in the morning, you know. Nah, not four or five o'clock. Maybe three, four o'clock. Uh, I just get so tired of it, tired of the interruptions. My mom goes, my mom goes to sleep around like three or something. Dad usually goes to sleep before everybody, you know. Baby usually goes to sleep around two. year old and my other two sisters got school so yeah I can pretty much record a video with no interruption really yeah anyway should skip to the six minute mark if you um don't feel like watching the beginning of the video and it was just me taking GTA 5 out of the system and putting GTA 4 in there. Stop fucking calling me, damn. I ain't hungry either. You know they're frying fish again. What do you think I'm gonna eat the same shit every goddamn night? No. Do like white people. Cook enough dinner to last one night, they cook another dinner the next night, you know? Or at least cook twice a week. We can eat TV dinners the whole week. Cereal or some shit. We ain't gotta keep eating the same shit you cook. That's one thing I hate about my mama. She says, man, she always saying, don't eat nothing else. She eat the fuck I cook. And if I do eat, and when we do eat some other shit else, she's like, no, put that in the refrigerator. You gonna eat what I cook. I'm like, are you serious? I ain't hungry. I'm like, are you serious? I just heated this shit up. Like, if I heat up some noodles or some oatmeal or some shit, she say, put that shit in the refrigerator and eat what I cook. I don't want to eat what you cook. Think I want to eat the same shit every day? No. <laughs> anyway, 4th of July 2013. I keep starving shit. Same random shit. 4th of July 2013. My neighbor shell. This is three years in a row 2013, 2012, 2011. All the same old shit, the same old family. Family never get together. Dad DJing, same damn music, same damn fireworks, you know, the ground fireworks, not the ones that shoot up in the air, and the ones that do shoot up in the air that we had was the ones that, um, when you light them, you got like two seconds to move, and when they shoot up in the air, it goes, <laughs> you know, those, not the big ones, but you know, the, the little ones, you know. When I got the skinny ass thick, mm, I said thick. When I got the skinny ass stick, pause. And I got the little rocket on the side, you know, little mini rocket. Those. We almost blew up somebody's car with that shit one time because of the way it, um, it flew up in the air. <laughs> shit was crazy, man. Because the way the street is, the street is kind of pointing it down a little bit, somewhat. You know, kind of like going downhill or some shit like that. And the way the firework was pointed, the little rocket, the way it was pointed, it went forward and not up. You know, blew up somebody's car and blew up. I mean, it popped, like, by somebody's wheel. So I'm surprised it didn't, you know, flat somebody's tire or some shit. One of them went under somebody's car and it popped. I'm like, oh, shit. We gonna get in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Before the party even started, I, um... I went behind the house. Well, not behind the house. I went on the side of somebody's house. Like up the street. Got me a lime burrito and drank one of those. Shit was good. That's when I had a strong burrito first. Took a strong burrito and drank one of those. You know, um, lime burritos and straw burritos or any kind of uh, burritos. Those have 8% uh, alcohol. And I had about four of those. I had two strong burritos and two lime burritos. And uh, that's about 32%. Um, but before all that, I left out the house, 
go to the store to go get some cups and plates and shit. And some napkins and other shit. Um, but before I went to the store, I stopped at the ice cream truck that was sitting down there. You know, when I walked down the street, the ice cream truck just so happened to be sitting there. You know, so I gotta go to the ice cream truck. And I went to the ice cream truck not to buy ice cream or juice or candy or hot sauce, just as most people do. No, I want to go buy some cigarettes. Most people in the hood go to the ice cream truck just to buy cigarettes. That's the one thing that they sell out on fast in the motherfucker. Everything else, no. Well, with females, they sell out on a lot of shit. The one dollar fruities, you know, hot sauce, this ice creams, juice, soda, and all that shit. They sell out on those with females, but males, I'll be buying cigarettes. Cigarettes, black and miles, capones, you know, just all those. Motherfucker shooting again, I heard that. When that go on, you better go and eat. You gonna force us to eat, goddammit? They don't know. Motherfuckers always shooting out there, man. Just two weeks ago, motherfuckers was out, motherfuckers was out there shooting. Early in the morning, but now, what time is it? Damn, control be turned on. Nine away, motherfuckers shooting already. Anyway, my cousin came over. You know, he brought a he brought a bottle of Patron, big ass bottle of Patron. He said, "Who wants to take the first sip?" I'm like, "I, right, I take it." He said, "You want to count for?" I'm like, "Hell no, nah. I'm a motherfucker. Gee, I drink straight out the bottle. You know what I'm saying it's just like sharing the phone. We cousins, so yeah, we blood. We can drink after each other. So I took the first sip out of the bottle. After it wasn't a sip, I just took it to the head. You know." Like, I kind of added on to the 8% of alcohol, you know, 32% with the two strawberries and the two lime I already had four of those. So, then he rolled up a blunt. We got into his car. We started smoking blunt. I got halfway high. Well, I didn't, yeah, I was halfway high. Then after that, I smoked another cigarette, and I just felt good. I enjoyed my night. I was bored as shit. That was the only thing that actually made me excited. Smoking weed. Taking a bottle of Patron to the head. Two Lamaritas. Two Strawberitas. Mm. Couldn't get any better. Well, did I say weed? Yeah, weed. Cigarettes. <laughs> Bro, this is when I love to smoke cigarettes. I would smoke like I ain't give a fuck. I just smoke just to smoke. Nowadays, when I do smoke, it's due to, it's due to stress. And, uh, you know, just to get my day started, just to end the day. You know, I go long as day, you gotta smoke a cigarette, you know. Just to get the bullshit off your mind. Same with in the morning. If your mama pissing you off early in the morning, you gotta smoke a cigarette just to get that shit off your mind. I actually do that shit every day. Now I smoke every other day. I don't smoke every single day. I cut back on that shit. Yeah, that was about it though. Like I was saying, same old music, same old fireworks. Same damn people three years in a row. It's pure bullshit. The only thing different is that I did almost get some from my from my neighbor's um from my neighbor's daughter's cousin. Same age as me, but she left early. And I'm like, fuck. Man, I wasn't even single. I'm lying like shit. I was single. You know, me and my girl broke up in 2012 and got back together in September. September 29, 2013. So, yeah, I was single. So, well, that's about it. Leave a like, leave a comment. Add me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter and all that bullshit. And I'll see you guys in about half an hour, alright? Peace.